You are strong. Indeed, one might even say exceptional. Thank you very much. But I grow weary of our standoff. The time has come to end it, I think. Before we do, though, permit me to ask, what would you say to becoming, well, in a word, my underling? I'd really hate to waste so talented a combatant. Not to mention I'm in need of a suitable replacement for Captain Ginyu. Am I being offered a job? Wow, says a lot about you that you think I'd go for that. A predictable response. The Saiyans are such a prideful race, <laughs> which is to say foolish. Sadly, only one outcome remains for you then. Your defeat. Hello, 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 hello. What's up, guys? MarJack79 here, and finally, I got another Dragon Ball Z action figure review for you guys. Man, I was getting a little bit. I was getting, I was getting sad, man. I was like, man, I need a new DBZ figure. Bad. What's going on with me? Sheesh. It's like the base of my channel. Goodness. All right. So today we are taking a look at the SH Figure Arts Frieza, the Resurrection F Saga Frieza, or the 2.0. Whatever you want to call him. You see he's got the cool looking halo right, right there. Because he is technically dead in this form. <laughs> so we got the figure the figure here. Got some heads. Look at that. It looks really cool. He got a, he's got an air uh, face. He's got an ah uh, face. He's got a <laughs> face. He's got the halo. The hands. Got some uh, artwork here. Looking cool. Probably the face I'm going to go with right there. The one he's already in. That's the, I feel like that's the most iconic Frieza face there. I uh, got the fun animation. The warning 15 and up for age. Bandai Tamachi Nations. Dragon Ball Z. Or Super. Resurrection F. Whatever you want to call it. The Toei Animation Certificate of License Grant. Bandai 2008. Made in China. So spin them off to the side. You get a foot. You get a screaming face, or ah, uh, you get a pointing of the death beam face. As his figure arts Frieza, spin up to the back. Frieza, super modeling action, master crafted, sculpted, ac accurately depicts Frieza form in meticulous detail. Got some cool pictures of him here. We got him firing off the death beam, holding the death ball, punching the awakening Goku. Um, got him flying off here. Super action, simple style, and heroic action. A uh, full array of interchangeable head and face parts allow for expressive, expressive portrayal of Frieza. Got some Japanese writing, a choking hazard for ages 15 and up. Blah, 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 blah. Bluefin, Tamashi Nations. Got a barcode here. And uh, yeah, that's it. I got this figure from Ageless Geeks. Shout out for $65. So they are awesome. Definitely if you're into uh, collecting the uh, Dragon Ball Z figures from figure arts that is the place to be and that is the place to go all right man so let's go ahead and crack this baby open and let's take a look shall we all right ladies and gents and we are back so we got our freezer out of the out of the package here he is uh from uh, the from an aesthetic standpoint he is absolutely beautiful um get a look at the face hair the top of the head the purple is shining it looks good shoulder blades looks really good man shoulder blades to the stomach to the body here, to the torso, to the groin, to the legs, to the shins and the feet. It looks really good, man. Definitely no complaints when it comes to that. Let's uh, spin them around here. So, so get a look at them from the back here. You can see the head, top of the head here for the uh, halo. It's got the hole. Um, got the back of the neck and the uh, shoulder blades here. Um, actually. The uh, other freezer that I have in my collection, Shoulder Blaze, is white. So I think I definitely like the uh, black or the darker purple a lot better. That looks sucks a lot better. Uh, just not noticing. Got a little bit of a blue scuff mark right there. That's kind of unfortunate. So see that? That's kind of weak. It's all right, though. Got some a little bit of shading in the back here. Spin around. Get a look at them from the side here. 
pretty cool and nice so so yeah man looks really good um yeah definitely uh like him a lot for uh, 65 dollars he definitely looks a lot better i think than the older one i had in my collection but like the title suggested i will have a comparison and right after we look at some of his articulation be right back okay take freaking 47 life of a youtuber guys jesus christ it's killing me today I don't know, man. Okay, it's enough of my complaining. Take a look at this articulation. So, okay, head move downwards that much. Blah, move upwards that much. Blah, could rotate 360 degrees. Tilt to the left, tilt to the right. Look at that. Bam. Arm rotate 360 degrees. We have uh, some bicep it's crunch like that. Uh, we have some bicep swivel. Bam, just like that. You have some wrist, some wrist swivel ro rotation. Bam, look at that. If I can rot push the wrist up that much, uh, not push the arm out or the hand out. Just pop that back in here. Just a second. Uh, there we go. So push the hand in about that much. What pops out, push it outwards about that much. Okay, so. Uh, torso is going to be rotated 360 degrees. Push the arms out that much. Uh, actually, never mind. This torso can be rotated 360 degrees. It can, it can be swiveled uh, to the left and to the right, but it cannot rotate that much. So, I think it's because of the little purple piece here that, that hinders it a bit. So. So yeah, keep that in mind. Don't don't try to force it because you'll because it feels like it's gonna it's, it's gonna it's gonna break when I try to twist it more than than right there. So okay, now so for the leg, uh, can be pushed outwards a little bit, then pushed backwards that much. Be pushed forwards and get some good kicks there. About right about about right there. Um, and push the knee back. Bam! About right there. And get that and get that much out of the out of the knee. Knee joint here, not bad. Swipe gets the job done. Straighten that back, back out. You do have some thigh swivel a little bit. Uh, or just push the leg right out, just like that. Okay. So reviews is going great, guys. It's going great. Let me, yeah, let me tell you. Okay. So just like that. And then push the foot out here. Push it, push it inwards. About that much. You can push it outwards about that much you can get them into those flying poses and so bing, bing 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 bang okay so let's take a look at some of the uh accessories that he comes with too as well so okay so like i said the head here guy he's got the gear head he's got the yelling head he's got the fisted hand right there he's got a death beam hand right there got the other handed death beam fist got some kind blasting hands here got the death beam here got the death ball here he's got an outstretched tail here he's got the arm folded hands here and he's got the feet that's supposed to claw onto the rock here where he kills krillin but it doesn't this doesn't come with the rock though so but i mean it most but most likely if you're if you're getting this figure then you probably have either the the tong figure or the older sh figures figure as well so so you can just use it on that rock and i think he also comes with a base too but uh, I'm, I'm i'm not taking that out, out of the package right now so but y'all should know what an SRS figure arch uh, stand should look like at this point if you're collecting the, the figures um, we have and then we also have the halo here so plug that in just, just as so oh, let's spin it around plug that in just like so now there we go so that's what he looks like with his halo in here so let's straighten that back out push his arms back down okay there we go so so let's go ahead and bring up our older freezer and we will take a look at the comparison of the the tall freezer and the newer sh figures resurrection freezer be right back all right ladies and gents so the moment we've all been waiting for we are looking at a comparison of this is 
the first freeze that I had in my collection, well actually not the first, this is actually the second, believe it or not. This is the Datong freezer from made in made in China because I started collecting after the first freezer got discontinued compared with the new SH Figures freezer. So you can automatically tell just by looking at the face how much better the SH Figures version is than the Datong. I mean it's not even it's not even closer, you guys. I mean look at that face and then look at that face. That looks like he hopped right out of the cartoon. And you can tell that that is clearly a carbon copy of this figure here. So, and then obviously, I mean, it's definitely more anime accurate here. You got definitely more purplish purple here. That's kind of a more pinkish purple. So, um, got the um, the shading. You know, a lot of I was hearing a lot of people saying that they like the shading on this one better. But to be completely honest, I like all the shading on this one better, man. I, I don't think it's close, honestly. I mean, you know, just just uh, no, I mean, just look at it. I mean, let me just get a uh, get a little bit more light into it. I mean, look at that. Look at the shading here. I mean, you can see it inside of the biceps on the thighs. I mean, you can see the shading here. I mean, it's, I mean, you got some bluish shading here and then this more of a blackish shading here. So I really think that's definitely more anime accurate here. So yeah, man, um, I don't know what people are talking about saying that they like this one shading and shading better. It's not even close. So, I mean, you can make your decision. I mean, like I said, I got this from Azel's Ages, Geese for $65. Uh, when I got this, uh, the Tom figure, I think he was around 40, but I mean, obviously you definitely get what you pay for. So yeah, man. So uh, I would definitely uh, get this figure as fast as possible because I don't know for some reason SH Figure Arts is cutting their uh, their uh, stock. So you know he's probably not gonna last on the market for very long before he explodes in uh, price. So so uh, yeah. So if you uh, like this video, go ahead and do me a favor, hit that like button for me. We really appreciate it. Um, if you want to see more Dragon Ball Z videos. Now you can hit that subscribe button. You can follow me at youtube.com slash smartjack79 at facebook.com slash smartjack79. And as always, I hope to see everybody on the next one. Until then, I will catch you guys later. Bye. All right, now we're back. So let's go ahead and take a look at Mr. Freeze's articulation. Damn it. Fuck. This bug right here. What the hell, dude? God, really? Oh. And he's gone. Yeah. See that? <laughs> oh. Goodbye, Mr. Mr. Bug.